Hello everyone, and welcome back to Let's Play The Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time 3D! We are about to enter the first dungeon of the game, the Deku Tree. So we just wander straight into his big wooden mouth. Oh great, webs. Wow, look at this place, it looks incredible. There's a ladder. Let's deal with these babas. So yeah, one strike to straighten them out, and the second one to uh, turn them into a stick. Okay. Apparently, L targeting is set to hold. That's fine. I want a deeper stick. I want to get nuts. There we go, deeper nuts. Hey, <laughs> they're not 2D anymore on the ground. Wow, that's cool. It's the simple things. Navi just wants to tell me there's a web on the ground. I know there's a web on the ground, honey. I know. Alright, well. Let's head it. Look at this wall, there are vines growing. You can climb vines. Okay. Wow, Link climbs really fast. Well, that alone justifies this purchase. Hmm. Alright, this way. Some skull wall colors there. Skull wall Tuller. Oh, uh, is it Skull wall -tula? Like Tarantula? Probably is. I don't know. Anyway. Ta -da -da -da. Oh yeah, we got that dungeon map home. Yeah, ignore that dude. For now, there's nothing we can do to them. So let's just head over here. I know how to open doors. Jesus. Okay. Oh no, a Deku scrub. Huh. You want now? Huh? Forgive me, master. If I give you a tip, will you let me go? No. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mwah, ha, ha. He laughs like Wario. Alright. Let's just, uh, head across here. And another super fantastic treasure chest. Well, what's inside this one? Oh, it's the fairy slingshot. Alright. Sweet. Now is the time to equip these items. So, let's see. I'll put that on uh, Y. I'll put those on X. And I'll put those on the touch screen. How do I do that? Do I drag them across? Okay, so that's how that works. Cool. You just tap it and then you tap where you want it to go. But for now, let's see. Great. Just knock that ladder down and we can get out of here. Let's cut these plants first. Get some Deku seeds. They're ammo for your slingshot. Alright. Back out this door. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Okay. Ooh, uh, now we're gonna go up this here. So let's kill these kill these kill these skull wall chillers. Or skull wall teller. I don't really care what you call them. And we just head up here. I'm sure they don't care what I call them either, because they're dead now. No. Oh man, his climbing speed is so good. Even the sideways climbing seems to have sped up a bit. That's awesome. This is a normal skull teller. Or sculpture. Oh shit, I have no sort of. Alright, cool. Now, before we uh, figure out a way to advance, let's just head in here. Switch, switch, switch. Okay, go, Link. Hua! Hua! Badass. Alright. Yes, that's the compass. Okay. Oh. If 
few more deacon nuts. Can't complain. We head up here. Push the switch again. Yeah, I know. Repetition, right? No, but we gotta head over here. Kill him. Kill this here golden skull teller. Alright, and we got a token proven we destroyed it. Awesome. What's in this? Just a recovery heart that we don't need. Okay. And simple puzzle to open the door, light the torch using your Deku stick. We're gonna be doing a lot of that, you guys. Alright. Nice. To advance, we need to break through the spider web on the floor down there. And to do that, we just gotta drop in it from a good height. Oh, okay, we're fine. Oh, the water looks really, really clear. That's beautiful. Okay. Well, uh, take care of this. Deku Baba. Shut up, Deku Baba. No one likes you. Alright. And uh, yeah. Kill another golden skull to that. Collect his soul. Because I mean, what else is it? They say it's a token proving you destroyed it. Why would they carry stuff like that around? I mean, they're spiders. They don't need a wallet or anything. So obviously it's their soul. Knock that one the fuck out. What does this do? Nice that touch. Alright. Awesome. Another gold skull color token. And oof, we go. Uh, I think it's just another recovery heart. Yep. Another thing we don't need. Okay. Yeah. Let's get our Deku stick. And, oh shit, straight into the water. Which puts it out, of course. Yeah. Let's try that again. Just run over here and use it to burn these cobwebs, lock in the door. And in we go. One thing I can't stand, it's scrubs, man. Not not the TV show. The the creature. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Teach me. You ever beat your brothers up ahead unless you punish them in the proper order? Two, three, one. Twenty-three is number one. Yes, I think you're a traitor. You scum. Um, like. Awesome, in we go. The eyeball switch is a Zelda tradition. I get, whoa, after I get in the water. Oh wow, Ruby. Okay, so you can now target to look directly down to the water. Let's save a very few times. You'll never have to do it. Now we just wait for this platform to come. There we go. And we can hop on this and just ride across to the other side. And the first time I played this game when I was like eight, I was stuck there for about two weeks. I'm not ashamed to admit. I'm somewhat ashamed, but uh, not as ashamed as I probably should be. Let's put it that way. Yeah, I know how to push a block, honey. Gosh. I had a friend in primary school named Ashley. And he was better at this game than me. And he tried to explain how to get through the Deku tree to me in school. And I was stuck there for like two weeks. But then once I got past it, I was flying up into the fire temple. Size of that, lad. Huh? I got five Alright. Light the torches. Like I said, this crops up a lot, you guys. Huh. Just head on through. Oh, shit. Now, uh, take a look. See those things on the ceiling? 
you can take your chance to whoops break them before you go in. But I want to show you them in case you haven't played. They'll drop down and they are Goma larva. Look out when it gets ready to turn. Ow. Alright, they die pretty easy. Alright. Done. Let's just uh, light up the torch. Now, there's nothing we can do with this wall yet. But look at the detail on it. That's a wall that you have to bomb. But, uh, it looks really cracked and broken now. It's pretty cool. Alright, anyway. What we do have to do is grab a Deku stick and burn the web down here to advance through the stage. So, burn that. Crawl through here. Badass. Okay. Yeah. Let's push this shiz down here. Because we got to get that fire up here to burn through another web. So, there's two ways you can do it. You can either just leave it here. At least this always worked for me. Leave it here. And jump at that. That's not working. Alright. Forget it then. Just push this down the hallway. And hop across. Light up with that stick. Hop back across. Or light up with that torch, right? And swing the Deku stick at the web. Anyway. Nice wet landing there for Link. Alright, now these are the three scrubs. You remember the order? 23 is number one, you guys. You do the second one. Out. The third one. And finally the first one. How did I know your secret? Haha. <laughs> In order to administer the coup de grace to Queen Goma, strike with your sword while she's stunned. Oh, Queenie. Sorry about that. You coward. <laughs> like doing some kind of crazy spin there. But anyway, in we go. To the boss room. Now, you see... The map on the bottom screen has got that skull of flashing. That I means the dungeon boss is in here. Alright. Doing under us. Alright, so the door is shut. What's that scrabbling around up there? Oh shit. It's really bright in here so you can see it really easily. Kind of ruins the atmosphere a little bit, but there you go. Alright. Alright, just gotta do it. Shoot it square in the eyeball. And she opens it to be all weird. Like, right now. And you get the eyeball stabbing on. And she'll flee. Don't bother chasing her. She's gonna climb up the wall. Alright. Now watch out. When she starts freaking out like this. Because she's gonna be laying some eggs and then it's quite a bunch of goma larva. But she's dead, so that's fine. Pretty easy boss, it is the first boss though. Dun, 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 dun. Ah. There's nothing that feels quite as good as beating a boss in Zelda games. Alright. And we'll head out of here and get a whole lot of exposition in the next episode of Let's Play The Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time 3D. So I'll see you guys then.